be talking about open doors and closed doors. When God closes doors for us, sometimes we take it as an offense and we react to it in the wrong way. But maybe the reason why he closed the doors is because the blessing inside of them was not meant for us. Maybe because when, when the blessing inside of them was not meant for us, maybe it was going to intimidate us the wrong way. Like if we have something good and like for example, if I had something I really love like slime or something and my sisters wanted it, I wouldn't share it with them. That was my blessing and I didn't want to share it. So God will not give us something that is going to destroy us. God is always a magnificent, not a person, but a spirit. God loves us. He's the one who created us. When God opens doors for us sometimes, the reasons why he shut us, shuts the door is because we're not ready for the blessing. The blessing sometimes makes us vain. This is why God sometimes closes our doors. But when we're ready, he will open them for us. He knows what we need. God loves us and even though we might show him disrespect sometimes, God will always be ready to forgive us because he wants us to love him. He wants us to manifest in this life. God sent us here to earth for a purpose. We weren't here to, to do all the things that these normal people do. We were here for a reason. God loves us and he put us onto earth to manifest something with our lives. When God decided to put us onto earth, he knew that we were special. We are all special. God wants us to know this. He doesn't want us to think that we're nothing and we came down to earth for no reason at all. God is here to help us. It is our choice to call on his name. And if we don't, that is not his fault. The reason why God opens doors for us is because he wants us to prosper. He gave us life. He's the one who created us from the day we were from the day we were born. God put us in our mother's wombs. He is the one who made us and protected us. God loves us and he wants us to prosper. That's why he opens doors for us. He opens the right doors for us. God, all he wants for us to do is to prosper and send the message of God to this world because this world is corrupting by all the bad things. Demons are trying to take over this world. But with God in our, on our side, we can prosper. God is here. God is here today and he is going to fight with us. He is going to be with us. He is going to stand by us today. God will never let us fight on our own. Because he's always there. He is the strong man for us. We should never let demons intimidate us. Just because they're from the spirit doesn't mean they have a meaning on this earth. We are God's kind. We will show those demons who's boss. Those demons are afraid of us because they know that God created us. This is why he tries to take us away from God. Because if he knows that God is by our side, we will win this battle. Demons just try to find the sneaky way out of everything. 
because they know they can't face us face to face because they know they will lose. God has pathed a way for us already from childhood and all we're doing now is just walking in his footsteps. We should give God worthy praise. I declare in the mighty name of Jesus Christ that as we worship God, we worship him with pure gold and silver hearts. Give God worthy praise. And in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, that we will walk in the footsteps that God has prepared for us, that we will come to manifestation in this life. And to clear out all the doors, hanging blessings, hanging blessings everywhere will be released. I declare that our life will come to full manifestation by the day that God's come. He is going to say, my children have done well. Even though the path might be windy and all the bad things may happen, I declare our hearts may still be pure to God in Jesus' mighty name. I declare that every praise that we give God, that he may accept it because we do it with a heart of gold, heart of silver pure heart. I declare in the mighty name of Jesus Christ that we are protected in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah.